Can you guys hear me? Good. Yeah. Can you hear me? Yeah. I'm eating a donut. Bro, Vince, you look like you got fucking kidnapped. And you're like, let me just record this pod episode real quick before they make me uh, work in the yard again. I'm offended you think I work in a yard. No. Um... <laughs> <laughs> Bro, it's just because you're so strong looking. <laughs> you look so strong. <laughs> look, Daisy's in it now. In the back of John's. Doesn't John look like he lives in like the back of a warehouse? It does. He looks like he's the the very strong man who works um, <laughs> exclusively in the back of a Goodwill. <laughs> What's up? Is my audio bad? It's fine. What's up? Hey, everyone. What's good? Welcome to this episode. All right, give me one second. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. I just drove down from LA because I slept. I slept up there. The girl. Listen, I don't kiss and tell, but uh. <laughs> Oh, I was at I was at a uh, year old apartment. Oh. <laughs> That's where I was. Bro, you're kind of nasty, bro. Yeah, but who hasn't had sex in that apartment? You know, not me. I I actually no, I fucked Vince. Vince and I fucked each other there. You never had sex at that apartment. Oh, uh, no, I'm just, I never had sex ever. I'm just oh. gonna keep quiet. <laughs> <laughs> Listen. Everyone, everyone that was there last night. Well, actually, not that's not true because Kyle was there. Oh my God! Hi, welcome. Okay, so <laughs> welcome to this episode of Love for High Award, and this is. Oh my God! <laughs> I rehearsed this in the car too. All right, welcome to this episode <laughs> of Love for. Not enough. Shut up! <laughs> All right, everyone, welcome to this episode of Low Effort High Award, uh, the birthday episode. That's what I was trying to say. Cheers. <laughs> Oh, why'd you say cheers? I don't have anything to drink. I don't know. I've just been drinking since I got back. I, I just got back like 20 minutes ago from Boston. I so, took the train. So oh, I, shit. So it's my, well, it's not, well, it's, so it's my birthday month and my friends here, their birthday month also. <laughs> <laughs> we're like all, we're all in a seven day span. <laughs> we are we're literally brought, in the same week. I brought the way up, I just waited for you to finish that statement. <laughs> like, <laughs> I brought on my friends here who yeah. have birthdays near me. That's the premise of this, if anyone was, if anyone was wondering. No, I think it's a very cute idea. Are you kind of hitting on them on the pod? <laughs> There's a lot of chemistry between you guys. No, I don't know. I just think, I don't know. I just think you're <laughs> cute and I'd like okay. to spend some time with you. Flip no. the hair, girl. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> my birthday's on August tw- 29th. Wait, I, how? Yeah, yeah. No, no, go ahead. You you start. Uh, I was to say, how old are we all turning? I'm turning 25. Me too, yeah, 25, yeah. Oh, my God. Big impact yeah. here. Crazy, right? Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, we're all getting old, bro. You're the it's oldest. Like, it's like the 2003 draft. But... Damn. Wait, I'm the old- Wait, I'm the oldest? Yeah, you're you the know? oldest. I'm the little baby. I'm the little oh, baby boy. Oh, come on. Hey. I'm a little young boy, so... Sorry. Damn. If you wait, and if we're the 2003 draft, what are you? If if you do, if I, I guess Vince would have to be LeBron, right? I'm, Le- because, I'm LeBron. Why would you? No, be LeBron? yeah. John Vince would be is, LeBron. Vince is the oldest. <laughs> no. Yeah. Be like, LeBron was the youngest because he was at uh, high school. No, I'm saying like because he got picked first. I'm saying that. I know what you're saying. Oh. You go, by, you go by draft, like number, and then what? However many numbers from Vince's birthday. I mean, I know exactly what your you're saying. Pick. I know exactly what you're saying, but I was saying facts to make it so I was LeBron. So. <laughs> as long as I'm Carmelo Anthony in that suit. <laughs> Bro, that's not, that's not happening. There you go. I'll probably, would that make me D-Wade? Yeah. Yeah, yeah he's 2003. Yeah, yeah, you're, yeah, you're like... You're... I was trying to think of like other people that... Because in my brain, I kept thinking of like Kendrick Perkins, and I was like, I do not want to be Kendrick <laughs> Perkins. <laughs> As a Celtics, a Celtics fan, fan, you better be K- KP. Celtics, I, do I do not want to be Kendrick Perkins. I do not want to be straight out of high school looking like he's 40 years old. Kendrick Perkins. <laughs> <laughs> looking like he already had a divorce. All right, so I should I should uh introduce you introduce you guys. I feel like I feel like Vince is waiting for this to have structure. And so I'm gonna it does it no. never does, but I'm gonna give it to him a little bit. Dude, is there a oh my god, who just happens? opened my door? That was Daisy. <laughs> Daisy. Damn. Vince is so confused at this. John is about to get killed on cam. <laughs> Did you see that? That was planned by me and Daisy. Mm-hmm. Daisy. 
Iya. Iya. How she doing after she got That was such a good visual dog. joke. Oh god. <laughs> Daisy, can you stop embarrassing? Okay, I'm gonna put you down, Daisy. Like, like you've never met me before. Look, she's not even looking at me. Okay, Daisy, I'm gonna put you down. This is Daisy's podcast now. Damn, Daisy's more confused than I am. <laughs> she looked like she was sinking when you were trying to put her down. <laughs> All right, so I brought my friends here today. Vince, um, Vincent. Uh, let yeah. Check, let me just check his Zoom name. Vincent Briscoe. <laughs> And uh, Michael <laughs> Michael Fleming, <laughs> 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 and this is this is exciting because wait we already went over the birthday thing. Yeah. Oh shit. <laughs> no, go over it again, dude. <laughs> <laughs> so we all have our our birthdays are close to each other. Mine is the 29th. I'm the 24th. I'm the 27th. There Damn. You go. I like our all of our room themes. Like I already, I already talked to Vince about this. I mentioned this the last time that I talked to you, John, is that you look like you live in a warehouse, which is kind of consistent with the outfits that you always wear on your podcast. Uh, big Vince shirts looks and like small he's... shorts is uh, the trend. So don't act yeah, like okay. big shirts, small shorts is not. Those are the only things that fit you. That's not a trend if that's the only thing you can wear. <laughs> Well, it's just that the, the trend... You're not ahead of the curve just because the, it's the only thing you can fit in. The trend's caught like up when with... when big suits come back, I'm going to be awesome. This is gonna listen, be the, the, listen, listen, listen. The trend's caught up with me, all right? That's... <laughs> all right, Michael? Fucking... Mm-hmm. Oh, you, yeah, talk to me about the trend's fucking green brim sticker still on it underneath. Getting the hat yeah. because some Instagram thought got it. Mm-hmm. That's, All right, that's man. Just, I'm I'm out I'm out here in New York. I'm trying to rep for Boston. I hope you get stabbed yeah. in New York, honestly. <laughs> I hope so too. I got a big fat settlement. Vince looks like he's like video calling us from like the late two thousands. <laughs> it's a little fuzzy with the yeah, Vince. The what uh, what what's your what are you working with here? What's your uh, you on a MacBook <laughs> Pro or are you on a Mac i iBook? Guys. Okay, <laughs> I'm on my Lenovo Yoga Pro and it works fine. Let's go. And, and I <laughs> listen. I'm not gonna dress this shit up. I I came out of bed and I decided I'm. <laughs> you got the Tree of Life poster with the pins in the corners, right? What? The High Life. Oh, oh yeah. what is High Life? What the Claire that- Denis film? Is that, no, a weed, uh, <laughs> is that a weed documentary? <laughs> That's on with, with Red Man and Method Man, right? <laughs> is it? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Well, I look like I'm like locked in a facility that's run by the Taliban right now. Like I look. Like no, I'm, like, you don't. You look like you're in your New York stand. apartment with your Red Sox hat on. She- okay. Yeah. <laughs> Let me I like. My I, I like how I'm kidding. Of- you're in Epstein's cell. No. <laughs> <laughs> they had to fill it up. Yeah. I like how in none of the selfies that Mike posted on his IG story of him on the way to New York, he had his hat on, but immediately when he oh was i had a com- different hat I had a when different he was in the, on. immediately when he was in the comfort of his own home that's when he felt oh, I safe had to put I'll, the red socks hat on i just no because this got shipped to my apartment while i was visiting my family never step on my line again michael oh great we needed to see this thank you michael <laughs> <laughs> that was worth it mike <laughs> Mike, put something on your wall dude at least at least at least Vincent yeah what the has hell this poster with the pins in it I'm saying I you've lived like there long enough, man. Yeah, I, I got a skate. I got I'm stuff in my wall. I got look, look at my. <laughs> I got That's stuff what I'm saying. <laughs> look, he, look at that in the corner. <laughs> He's got his like... social security card up there. Okay. John is tagging anything he can to that wall. He literally <laughs> looks like he lives in like the back of a warehouse. <laughs> those are all clothes that are getting shipped out at the start of the week. Man. Those are, yeah, you got past promo <laughs> items on your wall. <laughs> it's like when the, when they, when like, dr- like drug dealers in downtown LA will like live in a, a warehouse and like they're just mattress will be, <laughs> in, the, will be in the corner of, the, of like a floor with like nothing. I'm trying, I'm just deep in thought trying to connect to like an open air office with the idea of like a mass grave and how they're like the same thing. <laughs> well, 
kind of is. I mean, yeah, you kind of I was of, trying to make a... Damn, that wasn't a joke, huh? Damn. <laughs> you're, <laughs> you're, kind, <laughs> you're kind of just sl- slowly dying in the office, if it makes sense. Yeah, I'm, like, dark. Yeah, Vince is, like, a little dark. He, ha- he has a high life poster you're like i'm a little i'm a little i'm a little dark-minded i'm a little twisted i'm a little crazy <laughs> i i just kind of yeah. like i just kind of like dark humor you know <laughs> yeah you watch bojack horseman <laughs> i was talking to this person about like um like my stand-up versus like jokes i make in real life and i feel like my stand-up is a lot like i don't know harsher sort of i don't know i think it's just coming from like open mics because it's like um, the only jokes that get reactions at open mics are like harsh jokes, right? So I was explaining that, and then they're like, "Oh, so you like like dark humor?" <laughs> I was like, oh, "That's I wanna, funny." I want to kill myself now. <laughs> yeah, like, can I quit this? I'm too far. <laughs> oh yeah, so okay, that's what you do. That's like your whole thing is this one <laughs> little thing. That's what you do. That's great. <laughs> so that's... I'm trying to like wingman you at a party, and they're like, "Yeah, he's like a dark humor comic." Like, uh, oh my god, I would fucking. I would kill myself in the back. I will never move to LA. I promise you. <laughs> Dude, Vegas is a better place. I'm trying to go. I'm trying to go out to Vegas soon because my That's cousin lives out there too. And then also, yeah. like, my friends are doing shows out there where they're getting paid a hundred dollars. So wait, what? There's like this show that my friends have been going to, or they've only gone to a couple times, but they get paid out there. We're in like LA. That's laughable to ask for money. I want to go see John Mulaney. Yo, I'm going. Are you? Wait, which yeah. one? The Saturday or the Sunday? Yes, Saturday. Damn. Okay. I'm going with Sophie and we're also, it? yeah, I'm opening. And then we're also moving into our new apartment that same weekend. Oh, Hell in yeah. September. Oh, shit. Yeah, Congrats, big, big, big weekend. That's right. That's right. I won't live in this dungeon. No, I'm just kidding. Well, it, big moves, nice. big moves for I the twenty-five-year-old, dude. No, big I moves. know, but you were talking shit on my bedroom, so I was trying to make a joke about it. <laughs> no, there you go. I on my normal-looking bedroom. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, why the fuck you got shit on it? I moved too much to decorate my apartment. <laughs> Lived was, in three different cities in four years. I was gonna, I was gonna say that makes sense, man. I was gonna say, I, may, I was gonna say, it makes sense why your, why your room looks like you moved all the stuff out of it already. So that's awesome. No, yeah, yeah, I'll be moving in with Mike soon. Is she, is <laughs> she gonna? gonna my floor. Is Sophie gonna let you put up the uh, high life poster with four pins in the corners? Well, why? Are you, are you, why are, are you, you, gonna, you focused on the pins? Are you? Do I need to preserve this A twenty four poster that I have you, in my room? Are you moving into the living That's room the or, where is, item. or what? Or what are you doing with it? I'm oh just my god. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just thinking, are you, are you gonna upgrade to like maybe a frame? Just wondering. Oh, Vince is really salt of the earth kind of guy. I, I thought you were gonna say he's really salt, salty. Bro, chocolate ain't mm. chocolate ain't salty. It's sweet, baby. Mike, you better stop. <laughs> Mike, you better. Okay. <laughs> you play too damn much, Mike. You crazy, <laughs> like white boy. <laughs> like, That's oh good. my That's god, good. Mike. <laughs> Bro, it's it's been so hot at work too, because inside the kitchen it feels like Florida, like during yeah. a hurricane. Mm. It is like where are you dis- working? At a casino, at an undisclosed casino. But um Oh, you're are you money. a you're a waiter? No, I'm a you're busser a cook? and food runner. Um you're you're a chef? Food. Bus. Yeah. And but then you drive you drive a bus? Busting his ass. Yeah, that's right. That's right. No, but it was really bad yesterday because I like I was in the kitchen for like ten minutes and then like it's cooler in the restaurant. So yeah. like I'm running out food and then as soon as I step out I realize like I am soaking wet, like because it was humid <laughs> oh, and I funny. I got so sweaty in a second. Yeah. And I just, just imagine the sweatiest person you've ever seen being like, and we have the salmon. He's in oh, this call. <laughs> and like, it's, it's bad. I had a very similar experience yesterday. Let me tell yeah. you. I was in, I was at Mike's apartment and Cam took I a walked sh- up the and, stairs. And, and Cam took a, and Cam took a, a long shower. And then, uh-huh. I, say and, then, shit. and then I had to go to the bathroom and I walk into that bathroom and it's maybe the hottest I've ever felt. <laughs> that that, that bathroom life. had no like you literally had to There's open no the window circulation. And no ventilation at and, all besides and cam, a window and cam had literally just left the bathroom 
and it or and it he he had I don't know how he <laughs> I didn't even know water got that hot. How, how, how much he was steaming that room. It was a sauna. Bro, he takes he takes showers. I mean, God bless him, but he's like part of the reason why California is having a drought. He takes the oh longest showers I've ever seen. <laughs> and I long want... and inside of a kettle. Yeah, and then so that is such a funny condition to poop in. Yeah, and then I had to take a shit, and then it was it was I was dying. Okay, and then oh, listen man. to this, and then listen to this as you're trying to wipe. <laughs> <laughs> no legit no listen to this so then so then the, it wasn't flushing because your fucking tank isn't doesn't fill with water it's so fun yeah so the tank wasn't filling with water and it wasn't flushing and so then i was trying to like plunge it and then i got like shit on the plunger and then okay and then this happened and then so did were you did cam have the little cups when you were there or is that a new addition with jack you think <laughs> anyways no, there's there's which, little which there's little cup? cups like there's dixie little cups yeah there's little dixie cups to, to, <laughs> to drink mouthwash like i'm in the fucking like i'm in like i'm in a fucking holiday inn and <laughs> and so i start so i start filling the little dixie cups with water to try to fill the, <laughs> the, the tank up with water so that i can flush it and meanwhile it's so hot and i'm, dr- I'm just drenched with sweat at this point and i'm like filling up the cup <laughs> this much of water at a time at a t- <laughs> and then you know how in your bathroom you have like the uh it ha- you have like the cage <laughs> over the over the toilet with like the mm-hmm. shelves yeah so i had to like go like this every time underneath the cage oh god oh, they didn't have that they didn't have that and, when i was uh, when i we didn't oh, have that when i was dang i think he moved it in there because so, bro his, his so then I you could have the tank go ahead you could have passed out and then died from inhaling the poop fumes. Bro, can you imagine if you legit, passed out his face is just in the toilet? <laughs> yeah. We're like, where's John? <laughs> d- Opening that door realize. like whoosh. <laughs> Honestly, yeah, it was a it was literally like I was in like Florida or like Las Vegas walking into a casino cuz then I opened the door and it was so cold in the apartment cuz Cam has the AC <laughs> running at the highest thing. So I like all, opened all the door. Too. It was as if I was walking into a Walmart in Alabama, <laughs> honestly. That's then, so uh, good. You got like a dookie bomb mixing in with like the AC Yeah, yeah so it didn't day. so it You're didn't flush. Like a to- it like just a been pressure cooking. <laughs> It, it didn't flush at all and then i came out and i was like Yo, oh you guys, man. like your tank isn't filling with water i don't know what to tell you and then they're like it's all right yeah dude just leave the poop in there i got it dude just leave the poop i'm very sensitive with poop around like jack because jerky. did you guys ever i like took a huge shit at jack's old apartment and then like i went to work like i slept so i slept over at his house i've literally never <laughs> talked about this actually with Uh-oh. anyone <laughs> oh god so and Literally, okay, so I think it, this was after like the 4th of July or something. I like got so fucked up and then slept over at Jack's apartment. And then I had work the next day. And so I slept at his apartment. I like took a huge shit in his in his old toilet, right? This was like mm-hmm. this was like when the pipes were bad. Like remember like he had to get like all the yeah. pipes replaced. Oh, blame it on the pipes. No, he has a rock coming out of his sink. Like if you if you take the <laughs> filter off the fucking faucet, you literally what the had, hell? Like, no, dude. So it was, like sifting for gold. That's okay, what it was so, like because you had that many rocks. Dude, this is so fucked. So so I so I'm at work, right? I get a text message. I don't I don't even remember what he said, but something along the lines of like there's like a. There's like a disaster in his bathroom right now. And he sends me a picture, shit all over the floor. <laughs> and then we just yeah. never talked about it again. Dude, that's oh, so funny. that's super fun. I don't know why I just, it makes me want to stay silent. <laughs> Look at it. That's how funny. Yeah, we want to give you a man. moment of silence. I felt yeah, so Let's just let that settle in. Oh, Dude, I felt so bad. Well, listen, I, like- I, I flushed the toilet and it went down. And then I was like, and then I was like, okay, I'm fine. Why would you ever think that you're not right. fine after that? It's really weird that after after your shit, you decided to flush some dynamite down Jack's toilet. <laughs> <laughs> like an old timey, like acne, yeah. acne stick of dynamite, <laughs> a, a crate of dynamite. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so you guys had never had a bad shit story? I really thought everyone was gonna have one. Um, no, I literally clogged the toilet on the Amtrak today. The first thing I did. I was like, I'm <laughs> At like ten in the morning, <laughs> and I got uh, like a line awesome. of people walk back to use the bathroom, and then a I mean, second oh. later they would walk back up to another car and just wait. <laughs> no, dude. Um, Did you tell someone? I wasn't brave enough. 
Mike, you gotta, you gotta tell someone about that. I, uh, I made a boo boo. <laughs> <laughs> or don't even what say it was you. Just be like, yo, I went together. in there. And- no, well, like, yeah, hey, somebody, guess. somebody really. <laughs> Listen, we're all trying to find out who did this. Like, I, was on his hands. <laughs> I was like, you went that for like two hours after because it happened at like 9 30 10. <laughs> and I didn't get into New York until like one my time or like 1 50 my time, two o'clock. Yeah. I could have gone up and just told them that like <laughs> I went in there and it was clogged and yeah. I just didn't. And now yeah. I've just created this circus of like yeah. this line of ants that's like walking up and it's realizing funny, there's though. like they can't do what they need to do and then just walking back the way they that they do? did you think that they were gonna like check the uh tape like on the uh <laughs> and be like uh you went in you're in there for a while man so you're, <laughs> you're saying you there. went in and saw that it was clogged and came right out yeah I just, i'm no snitch you know what i mean I'm, <laughs> uh, I'm on a no snitch policy now that i'm back on the east coast i didn't realize this until coming back from the netherlands recently oh, uh that okay. that fucking jet lag can like fuck up your stomach for a week straight it was like only emergency shits <laughs> oh well so the, pro- the problem the problem is that i always have an emergency shit i never know that i have to shit until like it's right. coming out of my asshole honestly. yeah yeah that yeah. was me that was that was when i clogged the the amtrak was with an emergency shit also it happened at a, like the worst time because i was like i'm gonna miss my favorite part of the ride up it's like this beach in connecticut it's really pretty but luckily uh there was this there was like a, a sensor delay or something like that like the train just stalled mm-hmm. for like the entire time i was in the bathroom i'm like that's so nice that they stopped the train so i could take it, the grossest shit and clog the toilet so I could right not shit. because <laughs> you're in there taking the grossest shit and cl- clogging the toilet I, I, yeah I, I <laughs> fucked up the system like i just kept pressing flush and something in the train just went it it. there's no window it in the bathroom <laughs> You should have let the sink run on the hottest water possible. (laughs) (laughs) Bro, I I swear to God, I could smell it through my mask like all the way at the other end of the train because I was on one end and they were it was on the other one. Man, God, like I don't know if my it was my brain pulling a trick on me or someone like opened up something really gross to eat on the train. But the entire time I was like, "That's my shit." I swear to God, I could smell it all the way on the other side of the train. Damn, too. That's disgusting. I was just gonna say, have you ever shit on a uh, like a like a Peter Pan bus or a uh, gra- Greyhound? No, I try not to shit, Brut. I I would rather uh, shit my pants than shit <laughs> in a, on a bus. Like trains is like yeah, trains is like all cutting right. it. But yeah. I I got into like I was like I I got over that fear when I did that like London trip when I was when we were at Emerson. Oh, or okay, nice. And, like, okay. They have nice. They have nice trains. to the they Netherlands. Mike went to London. Okay, does anyone mm-hmm. does anyone want to brag more about their world tra- about being world? You talk. You their just talk about world traveling for the longest time. You not on here, but like just in general. You forgot. When I would talk M- Mike you also mentioned travels. Connecticut, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> I, dude, the worst New England. <laughs> dude, I'm pissed. Um, Mike went to Boston for sure. I want to go back. <laughs> to visit my family i would yeah what the fuck dude thanks for the invite yo you didn't fucking invite me kid i would visit your family i saw you at the fucking pack i told you i wanted to invite i told you i wanted to visit your family before i don't think they want to meet you why because they're racist no i wish i wish that was as simple as that no Uh, i do kind of have to dip though soon ish oh yeah because you have to work right when do you have to leave? yeah and i gotta like eat and shower before i leave oh my god so now, i know so, so now so there's i literally i literally just shit. woke up and i was like oh shit i gotta do podcasts so now this hard out has a, has a, has a soft out i got a hard out right here for you pal <laughs> <laughs> bro drop that camera down a little bit bro What's good, bro? <laughs> oh my God, Mike, you've been you've been so crazy this whole time. <laughs> like you're so crazy. <laughs> we should talk about something birthday related. I think, right? Oh yeah. Wait, what are what are our birthday plans? We can get into that. I don't have any. I will be I working. Have, on I don't that have day. any. Yeah. I, I literally have not. Plans. There's a party on the 28th um, that I don't think I'm invited to. So there's that all that all my friends are gonna be. <laughs> So I was like, this would be perfect. It could be my birthday party. And then now then they're like, oh, okay. They're like, 
you're not invited. <laughs> I don't know if you know this, but you keep you got to stop telling people it's your birthday party because <laughs> yeah. no one knows you won, and we're not telling you the address today. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. 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 So that's no, yeah, this is my birthday party. This is my birthday so, party. So, John, you followed us so to this person's bummer. house. Yeah. They're begging you to leave. <laughs> We'll see what happens, but it's it's all right. It's gonna turn out. You're like throwing yourself a surprise birthday party by just like <laughs> lumping it in with someone else's. I'm birthday. throwing them a surprise birthday. It's it's a surprise. It's my birthday <laughs> party. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the surprise is my party, and you're none of you are invited. <laughs> yeah. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna bring my I'm gonna bring a cake for myself and be like, <laughs> this is my surprise. That happened at a bar. You're all celebrating my birthday party now. All right, so I'll do I'll do the next segment. I'll do the next segment then. Okay. Well, this was very nice. It was nice to see you guys. No, Um, no, no, Vince. Wait, wait for this segment. No, no, no. no, Wait. No. It'll be two minutes. So this is what's the segment? Leave. I'm gonna go to your house. Yeah. So this is so this is new thing. And I got a Mm. I got a birth I got a birthday cake pop. You okay. didn't tell any of us to get that at all. <laughs> John. We're just watching you eat a birthday pop. I went to Starbucks and they said, I said, do you have cake pops? And I said, we only have birthday and chocolate. And I said, that's perfect. It's my birthday. Bro, there's a fucking Starbucks <laughs> in, in Penn Station. I could have stopped at when I was heading home. <laughs> it was a surprise. For who? You, we're just going to watch you eat. <laughs> This is your your idea of a segment. I can't get over. It. This is still just a food podcast. I was saying it. For <laughs> day one. No, I was watch John eat. I've never had a cake pop. Well, I have had one, but not this one. Not all this right, one. all right. You know, eat the fucking cake pop. We're gonna be like, oh, it's good. All right, let me see. Happy birthday! Happy uh, birthday! What's wrong? You got a bad one? I'm kind of gross. I guess it's good that we didn't get one then, honestly. Yeah. Yeah, damn. <laughs> because have you ever had a cake pop? Yeah. yeah. They're like undercooked, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. Yeah. I thought you said you had one before. Oh, yeah. But yeah, that was back. You just forgot you don't <laughs> like cake pops. <laughs> yeah. That's what turning 25 is about. That's off the cuff, baby. As off the dome. <laughs> yeah. oh, I'm scared, but you got the same look in your eyes.